Good morning children. How are you all? I hope all are doing good. Yes. I am back today with another video of lesson number 4. Yes, we were doing lesson number 4. In the last class we have studied, we have seen different types of houses. Two different types of houses we have studied. That is the kacha house and the pakka house. Example of a kacha house was hut. Very good, you remember. And pakka house, bungalow or a multi-storied building. Or flats also you can say, no problem. So today we are going to start with the same, continue the same chapter and we are going to study houses according to the climate of a place. Now houses according to the climate we are going to see today. So according to the climate different places houses change. So we will study around five types of different houses. First is the igloos. Everybody might have seen this in movies or when you see discovery. Everybody might have seen this. This is the picture of an igloo. And the people who live in igloo are known as, some might be knowing. Yes. Come on, come on. Yes, Eskimos. Yes, you know it. So, here is one picture. Yes. Now, this type of picture, everybody might have seen in cartoon movies. You might have seen so these types of houses, where they are found? They are found in very, very cold places. Now it is very, very cold means where everywhere you can see ice or snow. Okay, there you will find igloos. And it is made up of snow. Snow se bana hua hota hai. bricks hai. Bricks, wall. Jaysi apne the bricks kis ke bana hota hai? Eda. Hai We say eda. Okay, bricks. Eda se bana hota hai. Snow ka. Okay, how full house is made up of snow and it is dome like shape. What is dome like? Dome means upper shape of dome. This upper semicircular shape ka hota hai. Jo semicircular shape hota hai, usko bolte hai dome. Dome, where else you can find? Dome or maha dik sakta hai apko? When you go in temples, in churches, in mosques, you can see, you can see up. Upar se pura bol hota hai. It is known as dome shape. Dome means in Hindi we say gumbal. Yes, it is dome shape means semicircular round in shape from the top. Okay, so igloo is also dome shape and people who live in it are known as Eskimos. So you need to remember where you will find igloos, where it is very very cold and it is made up of snow. Two things you need to know. Okay, next one. Next type of house is a stilt house. This is new for you. Stilt house kya hota hai? Stilt kuch nahi hota. Stilt are what? These long long lambi lambi kya hote? Stilts bolte. Lambi lambi poles bolte. Bol sakte or bamboos. Okay. So these houses are standing on stilts. Okay. So one more picture is there. See. This picture. And you will see water. Why water is there? Because they are made a little above the ground. Why? Let's see. These houses are found in places with heavy rainfalls and floods. Heavy rainfall. Bhoot jaga paani girta hai jis area mein. And floods are there. Floods means when heavy rainfall hota hai and rivers will overflow. River ka paani overflow. Over ho jata hai river ka paani. To it, it comes in what? It comes in the surrounding areas. Uske aji wali jo area over river ke paas. To usme a jata hai. Flood a jata hai. So what happens? The house is there. It will drum. Pani will drop jayenge. So their houses are built on a little high above the ground. They are built slightly above the ground. Ground se thoda sa upar banate. Why? Because when flood occurs, water does not come into the house. Pani ghar ke andar nahi gusega aur ghar ko kuch nuksaan nahi hoga. Okay? And these houses are made up of what? Wood or bamboo. Wood se bante hai ya fir bamboo se bante hai. These are known as stilt houses. What houses? Stilt houses. Why still? Ye jo jiske upar ye poles ke upar jo khade rate hai. Unko bolte hai stilts. Isle iska naam stilt house rakha hai. Okay? So these houses, new term. Stilt houses found in places where it rains heavily. And they are made slightly above the ground. Okay? Two points you need to remember from this also. Third one. Third one is a houseboat. Now, where you can see a houseboat? Aapko aise dikhe ga? Aise dikhe ga? No. Very good. Where you will find it? Where there is what? Yes. Where houseboats are found in lakes or rivers. 
where there is water. Okay. Very easy. So, Kashmir and Kerala, yes, you can find households. People live in this? Yes. Houseboats are floating on lakes or rivers. This is the picture of a houseboat. And it is floating. Floating means that hai pani pe, you know that. And it is made up of wood. Ye bhi wood se bana hua rata hai. And you can find this mainly in Kashmir and Kerala. Many might have seen also. If you would have visited that place, you might have seen that also. Yes, they give you a ride also in houseboats. Yes. Next, next is a tree house. With name itself you can find out. Yes, tree house where you will find? On a tree. Tree pay house. Okay, tree house. So you will find this house in where? In jungles. You will find it in deep forest. Forest ke andar, ghani jungle ke andar milega ye house. It is built on the branches of tree. Ye branches hai, branches ke upar banaya jata hai. When some people go in deep forest for some research of for anything if they go so to be safe from animals they stay on a height height pe rehte hai so they build houses on trees and this is known as tree house next next is the picture of a tent this everybody might have seen yes tent Everybody might have seen. If you have not seen in movies, at least you might have seen. So where do you find the tent? Tents are used by people who keep moving from one place to another. Ab tents kahan dekhne ko milenge? Ya kiske paas honge? Un logon ke paas those who are moving. Moving matlab ek jagah se dusri jagah jaate hain. Like soldiers. Soldiers see? Yes, they don't have. They live for three, three, four, four months. Okay. For soldiers and campers. Campers call okay. Campers bhi jate, pahadi bhi jate, uncho uncho. So what they do? They take their tents in their backpacks. Okay. And it is made up of a cloth. Ye kapra jo hota hai, isko bolte hai canvas. New word for you, canvas. Okay. Tents are being used by mountaineers or soldiers. See, this like this. When, wherever they need to wait for some time or stay during the night, they put their tents and then again the next day they roll it up and they move. Next, next is what? Yes, this is very interesting. This is, this is known as caravan. Caravan, kya hota hai? Gaadi hoti hai. In this, all the facilities is there. You, there is bed for sleeping, there is small kitchen, everything is there, kitchen equipments are there, sofa is there, TV is there, everything is there in this small what? Vehicle and it is known as caravan. This is also used by people who move from one place to another and this is known as house on wheels. Kya bote isko? House on wheels. This, this you need to remember. This is the house on wheel. It can move from one place to another. When people are traveling, many people use this. Okay. Whole family, they sit in this and they go for 3-4 days or 5 days when they are going, they can use this vehicle. Okay. This is known as caravans. Last. House is a place where we feel safe and happy. Aap apne ghar mein rehte ho, to you feel safe inside your house. Okay. So it is a place where we feel safe and happy. And one more thing. There are many rooms in the house. This you already know. This you have studied in class 1 also. Yes. Tell me. Let's do it fast. Drawing room. Yes. Bedroom. Kitchen. Bathroom. Study room. Dining room. Everybody knows. In dining room. Drawing room what we do. When any guest comes, we make them sit over there. Okay. Kitchen, mama cooks food. Bedroom, we sleep in the bedroom. Bathroom, we take bath. Okay. Study room, we go and study. Dining room, we have food in the dining room. Okay. So, you know what are these places and what things you do in these places. Okay. And this 
very important balcony what is balcony it is an open space okay open space in your house where you can look out go out for fresh air oh last a uh, good house is the one which is neat and clean now i know everybody is keeping their houses neat and clean so if you are keeping it your house is a good house we should open our doors and windows to allow sunlight and fresh air to come in ye apne ek chapter aur pe padha tha yes we studied this in lesson number 2 staying healthy pe bhi padha tha why we have to open the doors and windows of the house to let the fresh air inside so that fresh air and sunlight would come inside why because it will kill all the germs okay our house will be ventilated and it will sunlight will kill the germs also okay so you have to open your doors and windows of the house for some time at least we have to open it. okay last a house becomes a loving home when people living in the house love and help each other i hope all are helping their parents yes uh, it becomes a loving place to live in when we love and help each other in the house yes now some people don't have house to live in. okay now you have to remember this from this lesson what we learn there are many people see they are sleeping where on the road side they have put one what what is this plastic they have put and they are sleeping there this is their house okay some people don't have houses to live like us some people don't have houses to live so what we should do we should be thankful to god apun ko god ko thankful hona hai why because god has given us what a house to live okay so from this lesson we have learned that we should help each other and in a house we should live happily with helping our parents why because we are fortunate enough to have a house to live in okay children with this we come to an end of this chapter and today's task is to read this lesson full fully you have to read this lesson twice okay in the next class we are going to do the book and the copy okay children have a good day